How you going guys? Sci-Fi back yet again with another figure. This time it's a very strange custom figure. Um, everyone's aware of the the new edition of Star Wars Episode 4 when Lucas added in extra characters, took out some. Well here's one in the Cantina sequence. Instead of having, there was a big red, like glowing eyed uh, Wolfman looking guy, they replaced him with a Rastafarian looking lizard smoking a pipe. And that's this guy, Milas. His species is Sarkan. And that's the figure of him. It's a custom made one. And I have seen better. There's the car. I mean, this guy, I mean, the guy who makes these figures. I buy him because mainly for the card and the reason I had to bust him out of the card is because I had to put him all back together because when the box came to me it looks like someone put their friggin foot in it uh, typical anyways so yeah that's the only reason I... but yeah the card looks nice um, the pitch is a little dark but you see what I mean don't you me less and the card is punched but it's nice, we'll look at the back of the card very quickly there's a bunch of other ones that this guy can do most of these I can get or I've already got probably the Tamika sisters are the ones I really want but <clears throat> I'm gonna withhold all this custom collecting for the time being and let's look at the figure, yeah it's cool Except for the colouring. I'm going to have to redo this guy up again, I think. It's too bright. His um, Rastafarian type t cause here. It's too bright, man. Too bright. No. And as I've said before, the face on this is basically... That's another figure that I've got. That's Catwall, another addition to the Star Wars Episode Four new edition. And all you do, I've seen, I've done it before. Just yeah, pull him apart, cut him apart, but. As I said, as I'm saying now, most of the Cantina guys have very. Oh, fuck, I'm getting a ton of light in here now. Shit. As I said before, the colouring of these figures, of the, all the Cantina figures, <coughs> compared to this really bright red, white, black boots, grey head, I'm gonna have to dust him up paint him up, probably give him a new jacket, also fix his arms up yet again. It's not a bad figure, it's not too bad. Um, I have seen better versions, <clears throat> I've looked him up online and other custom versions and some dudes have gone to some great detail and Jesus would love him. So yeah, he needs a smoking implement, um, you know, a bong or a shisha or hookah to complement the figure would be great and of course that cape's got to go I've got a few other capes in my box of magic tricks which means I have a bag full of heaps of other stuff that I never put onto figures weapons and whatnot capes so yeah I didn't pay too much for him he is cool the card is cool, except the pitch is a bit dark, isn't it? You can hardly see the guy. But it's still nice. Um, so I'm pretty much all over the customs. I've been burnt by... Um, one of my YouTubers sent me a link to... a, a eBay site that sells the Tamika sisters. And they're, they're fantastic figures. Absolutely brilliant. But... 
the eBay seller is an absolute prick and didn't answer me any questions. I got my money back. So I'm a little bit burnt by customs, but if anyone else has any sites that sell customs, let me know. I'll have a look. Give it a big thank you. So there we go, guys. It's a strange figure. He needs a bit of dusting down, a bit of earthening up. New cape, new paint, and he looked fantastic with a smoking implement. All right, guys, there we go. That's me, lass. Um, don't know if they'll ever make another... Don't know if they'll ever make a figure of him since, you know, we're coming to the end of an era. So, there we go. All right, I'll see you all later. Got another Star Wars one up yet. All right, guys, may the Force be with you. Later on.